Here comes the head of the table, the Tribal Chief. The following contest is an elimination match. Making his way to the ring, representing the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida. Weighing in at 265 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns. Well, here's a man who's held the Universal Championship for over two years. Greatness redefined. That's God mode. Part of the pantheon of all-time greats in the WWE. You can count on one hand the amount of people who've held the championship as long as Roman Reigns. The tribal chief of the bloodline showing off all of his hard-earned gold. And if you're hoping to take either of those titles, good luck. The Brahma Bull looks ready to lay the smack down. And from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, The Rock! Well, here's a man who's captured the imagination of the entire sports entertainment industry. The Brahma Bull, one of the very best of all time. Without question, The Rock has been a champion at every level. Hey, Saxton, your role, know it. Your mouth, shut it. That wasn't very nice. It is just such an incredible moment every time The Rock competes. Desire to be the best ever has been fulfilled. The Great One possesses amazing agility, power, and stamina. The Brahma Bull looks set to run over the competition here tonight. Here comes Jey Uso. A man who has grown immeasurably under the bloodline. And representing the bloodline from San Francisco, California, weighing in at 242 pounds, one half of the Raw Tag Team Champions, main event, Jey Uso. Main event, Jay Uso. The right hand man to the head of the table has held many tag team championships, but main evented, won the Andre the Giant Memorial Battle Royal. The sky is the limit for Jay Uso. Hey, Corey, have you been down since day one-ish? Saxon, I've been down a lot longer than you have. Here comes Jimmy Uso. The glue that holds the bloodline together. And representing the bloodline from San Francisco, California, weighing in at 251 pounds, one half of the Raw Tag Team Champions, Jimmy Uso! Jimmy Uso may not be alongside his brother Jay here tonight, but Jimmy Uso is just as cunning as ever. Hey, superb athletic abilities here. 
You can say that again. Jimmy Uso has the ability to fly around the ring and still hit like a truck. Honestly, guys, Jimmy Uso is the complete package. I've never agreed more, Byron. Both Jimmy and Jay have earned seats at the table with Roman Reigns, who has made both better. Six foot four, 350 pounds of rage. And from the Isle of Samoa, weighing in at 350 pounds, the Samoan bulldozer, Umaga! Umaga can be translated to mean either the beginning or end. Well, that's because when you face Umaga, it is the beginning of the end. there's anyone that is quite as intimidating as Umaga is. I've got to agree with you, Cole. Umaga has provided absolutely unmatched brutality in WWE. Six foot four, over 550 pounds. And from the land of the rising sun, weighing in at 558 pounds, Yokozu! Success in the Sumo Arena only topped by his WWE success, Yokozuna. This man once held the WWE title for nearly 300 days, and I think he could easily repeat that success again. Man, look at the size of Yokozuna. Even more impressive than his sheer size is his ability to move around the ring like no one else. A horrifying blend of size, speed, agility, and power. I think the ring just buckled. Well, unfortunately for his opponent, all of Yokozuna's weight and power is about to be focused on them. Uh, Saxon, stop dancing. I can't help it. It's like my hips and my hands have a mind of their own. And from the Isle of Samoa, weighing in at 425 pounds, Rikishi! Not only an all-time great, but the father of Jimmy and Jey Uso, the real person responsible for their tag team prowess, Saxton. And their dance moves, too. Hey, guys, you think Rikishi would give me a dance lesson? Absolutely not, Saxton. With any luck, you'll get a stink face. No, no. Rikishi wouldn't do that to me. The thing about Rikishi, guys, is he loves to have fun, right? But he's all business when the bell rings. That's the best part. Once the music stops, Rikishi, one of the most threatening superstars in all of WWE. You are looking at the future of the Bloodline. And their opponent from Las Vegas, Nevada, weighing in at 250 pounds, Solo Sikoa. Had a meteoric rise in NXT, multiple main event matches, and the NXT North American title. And has already made an impact on the main roster, becoming a part of the bloodline. Oh, 
When it comes to the street champion, Solo always puts that title on the line. And we have an eight-pack challenge match. Can't remember the last time I saw one of these. Honestly, the person I feel the worst for is the ref. Imagine having to keep track of eight superstars. At least it's one fall to a finish. And Jay reverses. Oh! Doing whatever it takes. Boom! Some superstars are understandably hesitant to exploit the no disqualification stipulation. Then they need to go wrestle a different match. This is the kind of match where you need to cross the line before the opposition does. If a superstar wants the W, they need to overcome that hesitation. And that was an efficient form of offense in that move. Ooh, dropped right on their face. And he's taking this to the outside now. And he has free reign to the outside with no countouts to worry about. Hope you boys put your running shoes on. It might be time to clear up. Sleeper holds in. In deep. Fading. Fading. This won't win the match, but it's doing a lot of damage in the... Pro and breaks out of the sleeper. Climbs back inside. Quick takedown there. Close line. Face buster, Plant. Here it comes. Stay away from the worm. Just stretching them, breaking them down with a half crab. Full crab, half crab, neither is a good position. Uh, look, able to free the arm and roll out. Great escape. Super kick! Leg drop. Now he's been put on the defensive. There's nothing off limits? Nope. Hoisted up. Whipped over in a snap suplex. He's doing a whole lot of gesturing, and it could cost him. And that was offense with a hurtful purpose. He's back into the ring. And an impactful display of offense we just witnessed there. Crank in the head. That didn't go as Solo pictured. Taking out the knee. Oh! Crank around into a neck breaker. Double boots. Oh, double DDT. Russian leg sweep. Oh, oh wicked kick to the lower back. Oh, what a kick to the face. My God. And he sends him into the corner. Bulldog. Oh, he's got him here. He's got him up. And, and that definitely made solid impact. Knew what was coming there. Just saw some serious offense. Whoa, stiff headbutt. Up they go. Oh, atomic drop. Ooh, vicious headbutt. Dragon yeah, gets a corner out of the corner and a thunderous headbutt from Yoko. He's only going to get worse for the opponent of Yoko Zuna. From the middle row. Effective body blow. I don't think anyone's questioning how Jay Uso feels. Raise. He's got him scouted. This won't win the match, but it's one way to inflict a great deal of punishment on an opponent. It's a roundabout strategy, but it might work. Great job refocusing. He is desperately trying to maneuver out of this and successfully does. Headbutt by Kishi. Getting his opponent in position. Turn out the lights. The party is over. And that was an efficient display of offense with that maneuver. Rikishi got all of it. At this juncture, you have to wonder if these superstars can keep up this pace. They're certainly being taken into the deep waters now. Oh! He grabbed the chair. Uh, now would be a good time to run. And some effective offense with that one. Good night. Ooh, that hurt. Kidney. Be woozy after that impact. He'll head to the ring. Textbook. Here it comes. What? Oh, and Umaga's laid out. Oh, 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 what a nasty kneeler. There's a leg 
electricity running through this arena right now. Will it be the spark for one of these competitors? Battling at ringside can be very unforgiving. You have to be careful out there. No protection out here. No safe confines to speak of. The big dog had that scouted. Uh-oh. Ah, Rikishi is all business now. Power bomb! He's doing a whole lot of gesturing, and it could cost him. Claw in the face! Is this necessary? Rip it at the eyes! Big time clothesline. Good grief. Clearly hoping something nefarious is beneath the ring. He's got a kendo stick. Uh-oh. Umaga with a reversal. What the lagger? And this match will head back to the ring. The admiration for these superstars is echoing throughout this arena right now. Oh, man. Headbutt to the back of the neck. Oh, close line. And they just busted out an impactful maneuver. Guys, they are getting way too close for comfort here. Yeah, I've seen this before, and it doesn't end well. He's a projectile now. Here's the arm ringer. Wow, oh, what a shot. Good defense. Oh, 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 what a boot. Yokozuna gets countered. The tribal chief oozing disdain for his opponent. Oh, boy. German suplex release. DDT. Spike. Oh, direct impact to the chest. And a well-executed move we just saw there. Ooh, hoo, hoo. He's doing a whole lot of gesturing, and it could cost him. Jawbreaker! Call the dentist. Rock. Oh, must Down hard. And Jay finds himself on the receipt. There it is! Oh, oh, oh. I think it's over. Taking it outside the ring now. Right to the kidneys from behind. When you're in an atmosphere like this, when you can't hear yourself think because the crowd's so loud, you find a way to do superhuman things. That's what these combatants are doing here. Oh, look at the double team here. Uh-oh. Oh, face first. Returning to the ring now. Neckbreaker. Could be some collateral damage on the way here. Everyone needs to clear out. Including us! Kendo stick to the skull! Solid contact across the chest! Jumping close one! Yoko says this one's over! Oh! So is the cut! Oh, we're gonna end this! The Rock telling him what he said his whole career. Just bring it. Big time close line. Good grief! There's some power behind that punch. Face first with a waist lock takedown. Uh-oh. Yokozuna only gets that look when he's about to attack or eat. He moves just in time. I don't know if Jey Uso can withstand much more of this. Yeah, but Uso's just one move from turning this around. Re-entering the ring now. Boom! A four. Winding up. Boom! Jay Uso has Spike. been eliminated. Jay, his lights are off. And he keeps his focus on an attack to that area. Out of the ring. What's his plan here? What a punch! Close lines. Good lord. So effective. Why? Here is your winner, the Samoan Bulldozer, Umaga! And what a victory, surviving and ultimately thriving in a match like this. Yeah, with an elimination match, your number can be up at any moment. But they've managed to outmaneuver all the other competitors here tonight.